This is the best Claude Opus 4 prompt that you can use to generate the highest quality SEO optimized article with tables, list, and also create the most beautiful custom HTML element that you can embed into the article. And this is all done with one prompt using Claude Opus 4. So let's go ahead and reveal exactly what that prompt is. So I'll leave a link in the description below for the prompt. It is the same prompt that I use in Manus, but essentially we're gonna tell the AI you're an advanced AI content creator tasked with creating the best possible SEO optimized article on a topic. We just enter in the topic here. For this topic, it is the best website builder of 2025. I first tell it to conduct a web search for the top three results for the search term and get some information. Based on that analysis, then create an outline do not be generic, do not sound AI, be relatable, optimize the article for SEO and giving it some instructions of that, format the article using Markdown and then create at least one custom HTML element that adds value to the article. And I gave it some examples of what that HTML element can be. And I also told it how to create the HTML element in a way that that code can easily be embedded into any website. And that is the prompt in which I've used. As you can see here, once I enter in that prompt, we can see that Cloud Opus 4 will actually go out and search the web. It searched the top 10 articles on that topic. And then it fetched more information from a few of these other sources, right? So it actually went ahead and not just only got the top 10, it went and, and got some other sources as well to improve the data that it's getting. And then it took that information to write a beautiful article, well formatted, article looks great, has emojis, has lists, has all of the information you would need. And then this is where it really, really excelled. And that's in the code that it created for that HTML element. This is beautiful. Website builder cost calculator 2025. So let's say I wanted to see the cost of the business professional plan. How long we'll be having that plan. We can see our total cost. So we can really compare apples to apples. We can add professional email. We can add premium apps. We can add premium templates. And we can actually see our overall investment, right? This is awesome and personally this is the best html element that i have seen that's been created from a um, an ai so opus is definitely definitely better um, it is a little bit more expensive to do the the calls but again if your quality is this high it's definitely worth it so again all you have to do is copy over the prompt it will be in the description below in today's video head back over to claude and then for search term you're going to enter in your search term or your topic in which you would like to write about so again, for example, let's say we wanted to write about the best email marketing tool. I would enter in that topic and then we're going to run that on Opus. So it searched the top results for the best email marketing tool. And it's going to fetch detailed contact from some of these top ranking pages. The idea here is that it's going to gather better Intel rather than just writing it without searching the web. It can actually see what other websites have done. What's the best practices that it needs to do to write the best possible article. So now that it's gathered sufficient information about the top ranking articles, let's analyze the key patterns and create a comprehensive article that outranks them. So again, you can see it's really taking its time to formulate its strategy. So we got a really, really large article from using this prompt on this specific topic. So what we can do is we can then copy over that. We're going to convert it into Markdown to kind of see what the article actually looks like. The 21 best email marketing tools in 2025 last updated May 27. So we can see that it's definitely updated. Reading time is 22 minutes. So very long, very in-depth. But as you can see here, we get some baked in HTML tools. Let me just see if I can find that very quickly here. But you can see this is a long, this is a beast of an article. And to be honest, it's actually really good. Um, it's up to date. It has relevant information, talks about things in which you can, uh, need to consider if you want to buy an email marketing tool. So email marketing cost calculator, number of subscribers, emails per month, and it will give you the estimated monthly cost, All right? So that will actually work once you put it onto your actual website, but this is just a preview. But again, overall, really, really in-depth article. I think that this is probably, if it's 22 minutes, this is well over 5,000 words, right? So very, very in-depth article, but again, really, really good. So for a pillar piece of content like this, Cloud Opus would be perfect. I am in the process of adding Cloud Opus and Cloud Sonnet 4 on uh, WordRocket. Um, we are literally right now adding in the model. So when you go over to any of the models, you'll be able to use Opus 4 
and we'll switch over to Claude 4 instead of Claude 3.7 Sonnet. So if you guys want to check out Word Rocket, we actually have made it so that a lot of the issues and bugs that people were running into when generating content, that is all going to be fixed now because once you generate content, it generates in the background. So it pretty much makes it less likely to have an error. And you can simply go over to your content and read it. And as you can see, for some of the articles, you can actually create it if you use the all in one generator, you can create it with custom images once you use your open AI API key. And when you go over and you save your content, you can see the content with the baked in images. And all you have to do is go to markdown, copy over that markdown, paste it onto your website, and those images are going to automatically be embedded. So again, doing the heavy lifting for you. That's the point of the tool. So I'll let you guys enjoy today's video and I will see you in the next one. Take care.